Hey folks, how's it going? This is Iron Seagull here, back with another mod overview for The Sims 4. And this time, Waronk was kind enough to once again send me over their newest creation, which is another set of vehicles. This time, they're mostly water-based, but there's also a couple of hot air balloons. What? <laughs> so, yeah, that's a thing. And uh, a couple of these are actually really large, so I haven't placed them down yet. Maybe we'll just <laughs> do that a bit later on in this video. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. So, um, yeah. They are based off of the boats in the Island Living expansion pack. I don't know for sure if you actually need them to work. I assume you do. But, yeah, we're gonna show off all of these today. <laughs> with uh, a household I actually used for my Island Living Let's Play years ago. Um, but I'll quickly show you the swatches. So there's a few for each. <laughs> yeah, this one's um, based off of the Outrigger canoe, so it still has um, still has the, um, the rudder to steer with. Uh, and then there's the surfboard that comes in all these swatches. Yeah, some of them still have the English text, but at least there's some um, ones that don't have any text on them. Then there's this fishing boat over here that comes in all these colors. And then there's this motorboat, which looks just like the one from Island Paradise in The Sims 3, with all those colors. And then you have these two hunter balloons. Yeah, all of these say... Oh, wait, no, actually, there's a couple that say something different. <laughs> Sims 4 CC <laughs> Warong Collection. Like, as if it's sponsored. Um, and then, yeah, I do wish there were plane swatches for that one. And then there's this more, like, um, Hunter Balloon. It's more common that I see. Yeah. <laughs> All those colors right there. Well, we'll start off with the, with the surfboard. It is pretty cool. Actually, I think I do want to use... A different color swatch. I played with most of these on stream already, and it was uh, <laughs> it was quite fun to say the least. So we'll um, set this as the favorite water vehicle just to make this a little bit easier, and we will ride around on the surfboard. Actually, Beth does have a wetsuit too, so she might or might not wear that. She did on stream, and that was, uh, that was good. It made a lot of sense. Yeah, so there's still the, uh, wonky getting on animation. It's kind of left over from the Aqua Zip. But yeah, look at this animation! For when she's actually surfing. <laughs> Even the sound is different. And yeah, doing the, doing the tricks, that's pretty rad. So she does have, uh, a good amount of fitness skills. She'll, uh, Doing the trick. Same with uh, Noel. We'll have him get into this uh, motor boat here. We'll ride around on the boat. Yeah, the surfboard is. Whoa, jeez, darn! I missed that trick. Well, maybe she'll do it again. But the surfboard is definitely my favorite one. <laughs> Hang ten. <laughs> yeah, it's also taken from the Aqua Zip. <laughs> yeah, so look at this. This is like um, something out of SSX Tricky, except it's uh, it's over the water. <laughs> Almost looks like she's falling off. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yeah, literally such a high flying trick. <laughs> Let's watch him get into here. Yeah, works uh, perfectly fine getting in. They still do tricks on these boats too, so. <laughs> It gets pretty wacky. It definitely gets wacky. <laughs> so, yeah, if you have a lot of fitness skill, that will happen. I do wish that the tricks were <laughs> disabled for these boats, but, yeah, for now, this is what happens. It happens with the uh, other boats as well. Let's have Noel go on the, um, the windsurfing. I really enjoyed this in Island Paradise The Sims 3. So we'll, um, yeah, so this is favorite water vehicle right around on the Aqua Zip. Yeah, that's still going. <laughs> yeah, it goes on for quite a while since the ride around attraction lasts a while, so just, uh, whoop. 
<laughs> just <laughs> holding those invisible handlebars. And then getting off of that. Yeah, they can use the um, the fishing boat here. Or actually, well, I mean, I guess the boats, they have mostly the same animation. So maybe we'll actually have her use um, one of these hotter balloons. This one reminds me of Bioshock. Except favorite water vehicle. Oh, okay. I think maybe I still have to put this in the water. <laughs> Doesn't exactly work on land. I just use move objects on to place the hotter balloons over there since I don't have a lot of room on this lot. Wire lots aren't really uh, too big. To <laughs> yeah, it still sounds like an engine when he does the tricks, but. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yeah, the trick animations for this one are, are slightly strange. <laughs> it goes through the sail, but. Whoa! <laughs> Yeah, so there's the uh, the windsurfing. Oh yeah, that one's kind of funny. <laughs> Not quite a dab, but kind of flying a little bit. I think he's supposed to be holding onto the handle, but it's just, yeah, maybe not positioned correctly. Uh, sail here? Yeah, because the hotter balloons are cloned from the Outrigger canoe. It is weird how they are the same price as the vehicles that they're based off of. So the surfboard is 4,000 simoleons while the hotter balloons cost less than 1,800. So that's definitely something that I think should be changed. So it's more realistic. Oh, geez, right, yeah, this just kind of uh, teleports up there. Kind of holds there and there we go. Woo, hot air ballooning. In the Sims 4. <laughs> I know there was that hot air balloon interaction from the, um, what is it called? The Passionate Romance mod. But this one is like an actual vehicle. <laughs> Sail around. It is still a little awkward that you have to be over the water to use this. But I guess that's really it. Like, that's the limit since we don't really have... Well, I mean, there's the bike, but... I guess then the animation wouldn't look quite right. And then you'd hear the bicycle sounds. And yeah, there is a sound effect for this. Though you have to be a bit below it to hear it. I don't know if you can hear it well right now, but yeah, there we go. Yeah, so you can, you can just, uh, you can go fishing. Though I guess it's just a really long fishing line. But hey, I mean, it's The Sims. I guess you can kind of make that up as you go. Just a very long fishing line made for hot air balloon fishing. That's not something I thought I would ever say in my life, but here we are. All right, here goes Noel. Yeah, the water effect has also been in front since this paddle boat is smaller than the outrigger canoe. Still kind of cool. But it would be nice if it could be updated with the proper paddling animation instead of using the rudder. Yeah, I really love the paddle boats in The Sims 3 because this is this is exactly the same one where it's like the regular one. I also really like the swan paddle boat though. Unfortunately, that's not here. Yeah, Aqua Zip. Yeah, they're also still called the same names, unfortunately. Um, so <laughs> yeah, here's this uh, here's this big motor boat. Um, wait. Why can't I... Aren't there different swatches for it? Oh. Yeah, I'm not sure why... Oh! Okay. Or wait, maybe I was clicking on a different object entirely. I know there's like the hotkey usually to change a swatch after you've grabbed it, but it doesn't work on this Mac keyboard, unfortunately. So, yeah, I guess I'll just look at the thumbnails there. I guess they're pretty similar to the fishing boat. Oh, uh, yeah, there's this blue one here. <laughs> Where... Oh, 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 there we go. <laughs> She's, what? oh, whoa, she was under the water for a second, but yeah, there she is, just standing there. <laughs> oh, boy. Sorry, boss, I'm busy. I'm busy, um, you know, doing, doing, doing awesome tricks on this boat, somehow, just defying all logic. Whoa! Oh, oh, boy, oh, boy. All right, um, <laughs> let's get the other one, and uh, Noel can use that and join on this, this, I guess you could say, chaotic energy. Um, 
Yeah, I haven't actually used this most expensive one. Okay, so yeah, the price of this one is different. This, it's 10k. Yeah. Oh, and I think that one is a different price too, yeah, 20, uh, 2100. Alright, can we click on the colors of this one? Ah, okay, that's good that it's working. Hmm. Uh, would be cool if there were maybe some different, like, designs of some sort, but yeah, just kind of plain colors. All right, I can just go with the default one. Oh, okay, it actually did change the text of that one. That's good. Sail around on the yacht. Oh my gosh, Beth. Never ever would have I thought when I first started playing The Sims 1 that I would see two of my Sims just tricking around on big boats. Oh. Oh, okay. I guess this one's more like the Outrigger canoe, so you won't see this particular one just uh, <laughs> just doing all these your crazy tricks. Yeah, I guess you could almost say he's like having his arm on the seat, though it's a little bit in front of it. <laughs> You're just going off into the sunset on this big yacht. It is too bad that you can't have more than one sim on these boats, but again, I guess that's just a limitation of the game. It's not really, not really the modder's fault. <laughs> what a contrast! This, is this calm yacht and. Beth almost sailing through her house. Oh no. Oh no! Oh jeez. Well, it's a good thing the Sims don't actually get injured from that. This will be coming out for free on June the 20th on their Patreon. But if you do want to have this now, then uh, yeah, you can pledge to their Patreon and download that right now. So thank you once again, Warong, for sending all this over. And uh, yeah, I'd love to see this stuff be uh improved because these are really cool i especially love the surfboard that i would love to um, continue using a lot more and i guess this this yacht is pretty cool too I'll just have another thing to uh just spend a lot of money on though i wonder if maybe this one should be even more expensive than 10k i mean the most expensive cars in the sims 2 i think were a lot more than that yeah, just be like, hey, I'm, I'm really rich. <laughs> but just, it's not too hard to make a lot of money in The Sims 4, especially if you have, like, <laughs> packs like Get Famous or Jungle Adventure. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, but I will leave this off here. So I will leave the link to the Patreon in the video description below. And be sure to subscribe if you want to keep up with my latest gaming content, including life simulations and more. So I'll talk to you all later, and have a great day. Thanks for watching.